We're in Windows 10, and I'm going to show you how to enable the administrator account, which is disabled by default. So click on the Start Menu button, and then go to Control Panel. And from here, you're going to look at the upper left-hand corner for Administrative Tools. Go ahead and click on that. And now scroll to the second option here, which is Computer Management. So double-click on that. All right, under Computer Management, you're going to see Local Users and Groups. Go ahead and double-click on Users, and then you'll see the Administrator account, which has been hidden from you before. All right, see this little arrow pointing down? That means the account is disabled. So you can see all, the only account that's enabled is my local account. So let's go ahead and right-click on that and choose Password. And then by default, it says Account is Disabled. Go ahead and uncheck that box. Click Apply, click OK. Now, don't forget to set a password for the administrator as well. Let's go ahead and put the password in. It's got to be at least eight characters, have at least one uppercase, and at least one number. So let's go ahead and click OK. Password has been set. So now let's go ahead and uh, sign out by, there we go, sign out. And click the box. And we're going to click on Administrator in the lower left-hand corner. Put in our new password. And now we're logged in as the Administrator.